But I really think that Knight of Champions is a is a match that um, or I'm sorry, Knight of Champions is a show that really is going to matter at the end of the day. I think that um, when you look at the card that they've been building and and the card that they have so far. Um, it, it's going to be fun. I mean, you got Brock Lesnar versus John Cena, one of the biggest matches they can do in WWE. Sheamus versus Cesaro uh, going at the United States Championship. These are two big dudes that can really beat the crap out of each other, you know, and hit each other as, as about as hard as they can. Uh, plus, you know, they're very athletic in the ring. Um, you know, Cesaro's always, you know, trying to come up with things that's going to make the crowd, you know, get, um, get going. And, and he's a really, uh, a, a, a wrestler's wrestler, I guess you can say. Like, if you've been watching wrestling since the 80s, Cesaro is a guy that you can get glued towards and really want to see. Ziggler and Miz are, are two guys that are, you know, really going to go out there and really try and steal the show. Um, you know, they're, they're really, I don't, I don't think they care if they get, you know, four, eight, or fifteen minutes. They're they're gonna take advantage of any time that they do get, and they're always gonna have a good match. I mean, uh, Ziggler versus Miz uh, easily uh, was the match of the night at that house show in Stockton that I was talking about. Maybe you were lucky enough to catch that match. I think they did it in Sacramento. I think they did it in. Um, wherever they went after here, Bakersfield as well. Um, but, uh, you know, the match at SummerSlam uh, where Ziggler actually won the championship, a lot of people were surprised by that. That was, you know, really good stuff. And, uh, of course, you're also going to see matches, you know, more than likely uh, Swagger versus Bo, which is a match that maybe not everybody's going to care about, but they've been giving it a lot of time on TV. Mark Henry versus Rusev is a match that I don't think people are really getting behind as much as they did Jack Swagger versus Rusev, but it looks like the Swagger and Rusev, um, you know, feud is finally over, and they're, and they're moving on from that. Um, you know, maybe we'll get to see two matches. Maybe we'll see the Bella versus Bella. Maybe we'll see the four way that I was talking about, but definitely Paige will be defending her Divas Championship um, somewhere along the way out there. So, I mean, Night of Champions as a wrestling fan, that's a show that you, you can get behind, you know. Um, I think that, you know, when you look at the history of time, uh, I don't want to spend too much time bashing WWE, but, you know, like, if you look at the, the Night of Champions of the past, they've, they've given us one main event that's been really, really good, and they, you know, they give you a lot of matches that just sort of just are guys that are out there. I mean, around this time last year is when Punk started moving through guys in the Heyman stable where Punk was fighting against uh, Axel, Punk was fighting against Ryback. It just was a long series of matches that nobody cared about, and, you know, it is what it is. Um, Bray Wyatt is a guy that's going to be out there. Um, I don't know what they're going to do with him. Uh, maybe he'll fight Jericho again. I'm really hoping that Bray Wyatt versus Jericho in the Steel Cage match on Monday night is going to be some sort of a blow-off match uh, for that feud. Um, we all had hopes. We all got dreams, people. Uh, but um, there's also you know Roman Reigns and uh, Randy Orton. Is that going to be a rematch? Um, you know, the, 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 there's those four guys you can patch up in about any situation. Seth Rollins is going to need a match. Is, is Dean Ambrose going to be back and they're going to have a rematch? Um, you know, we're going to have to see what they do with the last, you know, few weeks of, uh, getting us to the point we're going to be at. But Night of Champions is going to be a great show.